Well, welcome back to the channel. How's it going, everybody? I'm going to meet uh, Mr. Timofey. We are Timofey, my pompa bro. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna go um, fishing here. Uh, I guess we're looking we're looking for reds, uh, mangrove snapper, trout. We don't we don't really care. We're just gonna use some live mullet. Uh, might even throw some um, who, artificials, probably. Uh, stay tuned. Here it comes. This is the craziest game of chicken I've ever played. All right, buddy, you win. I swerved. It's coming at me. Coming at me, bro? Wow. Why did the turtle cross the road? See you later. Yeah, well, first things first, we got to get some bait. And we're looking for any kind of top water action, any kind of like little quick bubbles, and then we're just gonna cast right on top of it, see what we get. Oh yeah. We got They're the tiny suits. That's all we need. All right, we're fishing. All right, we got our first fish on. Pull a little bit of drag. We've got a trout. Spotted trout, all right. We got a little. That's a weak fish. No, it's a trout. That's a baby trout, little yellow mouth guy. All right, we'll get him back. First fish of the day, baby. See Timofey on the cover of any fish sticks box in your local freezer. <laughs> Definitely started to rain, so I uh, got my little uh, raincoat on here. I'm using a, uh, a pen battle. This is one of the original battles that came out. It's the very first rod and reel combo I've ever owned, and uh, it's, it still holds true. It's still, it's still working, so I'm still going with it. I got a 10 pound test on it with a, a 20 pound leader and a size two circle hook that I'm hooking uh, with a half ounce egg weight and a bead to a 20 pound fluor fluorocarbon leader. And uh, we're just waiting it out, man. Let's do this thing. There we go. No, we got, we got a baby. Baby mangrove coming in. Right in the corner of the mouth, it's perfect. He's about nine, he's almost there. Almost there, not all the way there. Let's see if I can calm him down just a hair. Let's calm you down just a little bit. Launch you. See ya. Unless it's a crab. Oh, I'm getting bit. I'm getting bit. Getting bit. Getting bit. Take it. Oh, oh, there we go. That might be a little better size. Another mangrove. Oh, it's even smaller. He's just a fighter. Getting hit. Getting hit. Oh, I think I'm getting stolen. Nope, still good. He's definitely getting hit. He's still kicking. Too many seconds. Oh. There it is. It's coming. Yeah, I'm definitely. Look, I can see it. I'm right in the bottom here. If you come close, you're good. Oh wow, that was a good idea, Tim. You got it back. That's the biggest spade fish I've ever seen. Keeper size on it. Yeah, they're they're good eating. Oh, and monsters down there. I'm going to be a little more careful. <laughs> do I do I get the award for the biggest fish or the smallest fish? Look at this thing. 
This is bait size mangrove. Wow. Some of the biggest Ooh, little baby. Of the biggest That's amazing. See ya. Go get bigger, buddy. Keep them on. All right. <laughs> Woo, we got a redfish. All right. That's a keeper, buddy. So nice. Get him in the light. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a nice. Oh, he's drumming. So you know he's a he's a male. Very cool. Very cool. Let's put him. Let's get him going. <laughs> Let him go. All right. Will you do me a favor? Do you have a picture? Oh, what are you okay. Oh, you put a portrait. That looks beautiful. <laughs> I didn't. Oh, really? That was an accident? Well, if you can't tell, the, um, the the sun went down. It is completely dark, so I'm standing here underneath this dock light. And we're just catching fish after fish, man. We've got Timothy down there. You can barely see him. But uh, we the bite is turned on, something fierce. So we were going to pack it up. But we're not gonna now. Now we're gonna just fish a little more. Oh, we're we're on. Oh, it's another red. It's another red. I'm coming to you. I'm coming to you. I got attention. Oh, it's a trout. I think it's a red. It's coming right to you. What do we got? We got another red. I'll just come up here in the light so I can see what I'm doing. There we go. Hey, buddy. Yeah, we got. There we go. Got him right in the lip. Yeah, right in the lip. Let's get it out. All right, measure him up. What? Are you gonna? He might be a keeper. Kind of close. No. Okay. Does he know what the thing is? No. Get a quick measure on this guy. Yeah, he he's 19 and a half. He's almost 20. All right, that's, that's a slot red. That's a slot. That's a keeper, guys. We got another keeper red. In the state of Florida, we can have uh, two per person. Guys, this bite is absolutely insane. This bite, the second we put a mullet in, it is just pow, 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 just getting nailed. Uh, Tim and Faye and I were gonna quit and go gigging, but you know, as things may have it, this is uh, definitely way better. <laughs> we have a, I just got my limit on redfish and we're, we're going to pack in some mangrove snappers too now, it looks like. We got one keeper so far, and uh, they just keep biting. So we're going to keep going. We're just going to keep keep it on, man. We're having a blast. Stay tuned. I just pull, pulled in a keeper trout. Nice. You want to keep a trout? Just keeping. Oh, he's gone. All right, we're back home. We just grated some um, mild cheddar cheese. We got our ta tahine, tajine. I'm not sure what that is. That's the seasoning I'm gonna use on these redfish. We got our um, tomatoes, some lettuce already pre-cut, got our butter. And these are just all the accoutrement I'm gonna put on top of the, uh, I love this sauce. I'm gonna put on top of the tacos. There we go. Heating this up to just midway here, and then we're gonna add some butter. So you pat your fish dry. I already cut most of the bloodlines out, but you wanna cut the bloodlines out, all the big red that's in there, in the red fish. There you go, just pat them dry. All right, let's add our seasoning. Now this stuff you want to add at the very, like right when you're about to put it in the skillet because it has lime zest in it and the lime will actually start cooking your fish if you don't. But it is fantastic, guys. If you haven't tried this seasoning, holy cow. 
it is so good. It's packed full of flavor. It's got a nice zest to it from the um, from the lime zest in there. It's got all sorts of flavors. Just get it all nice and in there. I'm also doing this one-handed. So here we go with our butter. Let's roll it around. Okay, we go nice and hot. A little brown. Keep it off the uh, heat for a, for a moment. Just let it do this thing. All right. One. Yeah. Lower the heat down just a little bit. Right about. There's good in between. Make sure you clean that later. We're gonna do about, we got here, 327. So when that hits about uh, 330, 330, we're gonna flip them. A fun little trick too. I set my broiler up to 375. Just throw these. I have all these racks right here, but I just throw right on top. Don't judge me on this. <laughs> it's okay, they can get hot. It gives it some uh, height. All right, put these in like this, and don't forget them. Let those crisp up a little. We are at 330. So we are going to flip these guys. Let that sit till that says about 332. So basically you want to do two minutes on each side. Increase the heat just a little bit. There you go, we'll just wait until it's finished. Don't forget about your tortillas. are good. Nice and, nice and toasty. 332. Let's check them out. Oh yeah. Put a little sour cream down first. Add some fish. Little tomatoes. I love these um, jalapeno slices here. Get them pre-made. Add some cheddar. A little lettuce there. And my favorite. Yes. It's a little spicy. That's awesome. Oh yeah. Can you hear this crunch? Delicious. Very good. Excellent. What an excellent, excellent dock fishing day we had today. Holy cow, man. I, I couldn't even keep track of all the fish we caught. A lot of them aren't going to be on video because a lot of them, you know, just weren't um, slot size. We caught tons of mangrove snappers. Like, we just could not keep them off the hook it was great but uh we only did get one keeper mangrove snapper we we did keep two redfish um i, I limited out on my redfish so i kept them gave one to tim a he's gonna take it home and i do i do appreciate you guys watching these videos man if you like what you see subscribe thanks for hanging out with us we'll keep it going um anyway keep it reeling guys thank you so much for subscribing thanks for being with me and um we'll see you next time